What's up guys, my name is Vlad and welcome back to my channel. In this video, we're gonna talk about new things from Chrome Dev Team. It is a DevTools MCP for AI agents. It is a model context protocol that brings the power of Chrome DevTools to your AI coding assistant. It means now your agent can open browser and use Dev tools that are available in Chrome. So the agent will be able to check if the website actually is working. It's going to help you diagnose network and console errors, verify code changes in real time, simulate user behavior, help you debug in lifestyling and layout issues, and do other cool stuff that are available in Chrome DevTools. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can install this MCP for your GitHub Copilot. To get started, I simply open VS Code, then press Ctrl Shift P or Command Shift P on Mac. Then write MCP column and from drop down menu select Add Server. If you know the name of npm package, you can specify it, or you can click Browse MCP Servers. It is the last item from the drop down. Then at the left column, select Browse MCP Servers. Then navigate to your browser, and you should see this page. And here you can search Chrome, and there is only one MCP so you can install it. Simply click on the install button and select install in VS Code and allows uh, Chrome open VS Code and then click install. And that's it. In this way, you will install MSP server. Keep in mind that VS Code will ask you additional questions to change some configurations. So you simply can skip it. Okay, let's check if everything is working. First of all, let's uh, press Ctrl Shift P and check that MCP is available. As you can see in my list, there is a MCP Home Dev Tools. Now we can open Copilot Chat and let's ask agent to check LCP scores of my profly.dev website and it start working. Please don't worry about this error. It exists because I have two MCP for Chrome Dev Tool. So as you can see, the agent has started work. It's already called the MCP server. Now let's ask my permission. Let's allow the agent to proceed further. And as you can see, this is the result. And now I've got the report about OCP score of my website. The cool stuff is that you can ask the agent to help you improve the score because right now it has all the visibility. Because without MCP, the agents actually can see what actually the code does. They could only assume, but with MCP, they actually can start the browser and see the performance of real application. That's why it's so cool and so important for web developer to have this MCP server in their list. And that's probably it. If you like this video, please don't forget to click like, subscribe to my channel, and watch my other videos that can help you become a better developer.